The Confederate flag debate is still heating up, but now Walmart is saying sorry. And six men who tried to interrupt a famous pastor are facing charges. It's time for your dash cam deeds. A guy goes to Walmart, asks the people at the bakery to make a cake for him with the Confederate flag on the cake, and they told him no because just a week ago, Walmart decided that they were no longer gonna sell anything that had the Confederate flag on there. Well, the next day, he went back to the same Walmart, asked the employees to make him a cake with the ISIS flag on it, and they did. He goes and makes this viral YouTube video where he rants and raves about how Walmart is a hypocrite for even making the ISIS cake and how it should never have been made in the first place. Well, Walmart found out about this and they are and they released a statement saying that they are sorry that the cake was ever even made, but they say that the guy should not have taken advantage of the baker because the baker didn't know what that flag was and didn't know it had anything to do with ISIS. So on Sunday uh, at Lakewood Church in Houston, Texas, six men went and started heckling uh, Joel Osteen. He's a mega church pastor and he's pretty well known. Well, those six men are now facing charges for heckling the pastor. The men were caught on camera and posted to Twitter of them making loud noises and getting escorted out of the church. And the pastor kind of just said, hey, thanks for being patient with us while we get these people out. And then he went on doing his sermon. Um, but the officials at the church say that this isn't the first time this same group of men have come to the church and have started a ruckus. Uh, these same six men apparently last month came to the church and were turned away when they tried to go into the sanctuary. I guess they knew who they were and what they were getting into. Today, follow us on Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, at WLB Miller TV, at Dash Beats, and of course, as always, hashtag Box26 for life. Peace.